Hey, fire signs. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. I'm Brittany from Brittany's Tori and Tarot. Hello, thanks for joining me. Happy Memorial Day. If you don't know what Memorial Day is, here in the States, it is remembering the people who have fallen, who fought for our freedom. And as an independent thinker, I do not claim any political affiliation. However, I do very much appreciate my freedom, especially as a woman in America. Especially to be able to do this and not be spoiled. So moving on in my meditation for you fire signs, the biggest messages was sex, death, psychic abilities, um, owning, being on top of the world, fame, infamy. Um, like standing there on top of the world is actually, you know, like prestigious. Um, huh? I don't really, <laughs> well, I'm going to say it. Like maybe um, using your sexuality to get there. I don't know, but definitely some health and death and stuff are in this, and I don't really like that, but I've said it. So, watch your loved ones. No, that's not because of you-know-what is out, but just pay attention. could just be an ending to a relationship or to a job for you to move forward and be on top of your game, okay? I get what I get. Okay, let's get three cards for the past for my fire signs. What is this about? Why did you give me those? We have the High Priestess. Secrets. We have the Five of Pentacles. And we have Justice. Justice, justice. Keeping secrets. Someone is keeping secrets here in the recent past. Or it will be recent past. About finances. About maybe kicking someone out of a house. Um, or losing a house. Or losing a person. Um, someone's not being open and honest. Maybe uh, psychically seeing that you're going to have to save your money here soon. Because someone's not going to be splitting the bills anymore, especially with justice. Justice could be a divorce, court hearings, fines, I mean, getting in trouble. It could also be clearing up that debt, clearing up that karma, you know, ending. Walking away, being free, and that's going to take a minute to, like, get your finances together. But someone was not... Clear and open about this. Give me the present energy, please, for my fire sign, sun, moon, rising, and Venus. I would very much appreciate it if you hit that subscribe button. All right. I am not your goody two shoes reader. I am what is in front of me because I actually have the gift. So sometimes it's more clear. clear but remember, a personal and a general are two different entities, my friend. I do not know the backstory of the people I'm reading for here. Alright, give me present energy. I have, what is this? Two of Pentacles. The Hierophant. The Five of Swords. <laughs> Choosing either a big change for, you know, something more established for yourself. Okay, also very spiritual as well. We got two spiritual leaders here on, on board. We have Taurus and Pisces. Taurus, Pisces, Libra up here in the game. So maybe you're dealing with them, maybe you're a cusper. Um, so you could be leaving a marriage and you're not telling anyone. The energies could go vice versa here. You've been flip-flopping with your energy. You could feel very tied to this person. Like, you know, they've been here for me. What am I to do? I can't leave them without a home. I can't leave them without money. Don't be secretive about it, man. Let them prepare. People got to learn to be open and honest and communicative. You know, so you can say farewell. This is Five of Swords. In a peaceful manner. Hey. We gotta go our separate ways now. Alright? I want something more structured. Um, your way wasn't working out. 
or this job isn't working out. I need something more stable. I need something that fills me with light instead of darkness. Remember, it's a general. But it's definitely parting of ways. Changing. A change. It's a good change for you, though, okay? You gotta remember, life is short. So while it might be sad, and there might be some foul words between a boss, between a lover, between a family, friend, we gotta live for us, okay? Now, speaking, and that could definitely be affecting my personal self right now. Live with an Aries. However, I'm not gonna be mad. I'm gonna be mad if I'm lied to. Alright? Give me the present energy, please, based off of... I mean... <laughs> Give me the near future energy, please, based off of this. Give me the near future energy based off of this for my fire signs. What is going on? Oh, damn. Too many cards. So, all right. I got half the damn deck. Three of Pentacles. The Knight of Cups. The Seven of Pentacles. Someone's trying to rebuild and start over. Looking at that lost offer. Looking at that offer that was tossed to the side that didn't work out. Okay. King of Swords. Single. Him and the Queen are not married. So it could be friend. It could be a family. A divorce. Okay. Someone's having to rebuild here. And they're looking at all those years or time spent. All the emotions put in. And nothing worked. Gotta cut it off somewhere. Someone else is involved, though. Okay? That's where the lie is. Here's Seven of Swords! Someone's lying about another person. Someone's lying about a new start. Someone's lying about an offer they've been given. Here's the Queen of Wands. Damn. Confident. Bold. Going after what they want. The Ten of Swords. Ending, ending, ending. With the Page of Pentacles. Looking at that hurt, looking at that loss, looking at all that effort, that time, put it into something. Okay, but going to use that to push you forward. Someone's using this to push them forward, that hurt, that loss, that betrayal. Okay. But also, some offer that's spoken about isn't real. It's small, it's pansy, it's nothing compared to what they could help you with, or what you could help them with. It's a, it's a lie. It's all a lie. Not cool, dude. Not cool. Underneath the deck here, I have the moon. Again, the path is not lit. There are secrets involved. It's also sex, psychic realms, Cancer Pisces. I have the Four of Swords. I have the Page of Wands with the Seven of Cups. With the world in the tower. I can't avoid this. I can't avoid this. You can't avoid this. Too many options. Um, sickness. Time out. Breakup. Too many things going on around your head. You're wanting to end it. Okay? With the world. Endings and beginnings. Because. An upheaval. An upheaval. Something happening, someone dying, someone breaking up, someone... You don't hear me say die very often. There's some health here. That it's psychic, it's sex-related, it's relationship-related, it's money-related. There's a lot of lies messed up in this. Okay, There's so many messages that came to me before. It just blows my mind sometimes when I really get the time to sit and meditate. That's why it's very important that you guys hit that subscribe button. Because a lot of things worth anything take time and take patience so I appreciate when I'm able to cipher in for you okay it takes a lot of time to do these and put them up and make sure they're proper for you all oh, oh my goodness gracious just speak up I don't know who this is for but it's like mm. Mm. <laughs> what is the obstacle for Aries, Leo, Sag, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. What is the obstacle of dealing with this that they need to overcome? What looked out? Leo, here you are with the sun. Leo, here you are with strength. And then what do we got? Knight of Swords. That's an obstacle. Ah. Uh, 
The obstacle with, okay, straight, sun, nine of swords, clear, communicative, enlightening, telling the truth, being open, being honest, having the strength to do so and not be scared to do it. That is your obstacle. That is to fully be happy, to fully be undressed, to fully be open, okay, and having the courage and the strength to do so, to speak up. It can't be one-sided. It can't be held back. It can't be a secret. The Knight of Swords comes in to say, and it may be swift, but it needs to be said before it's just no time. No no time. There's no time. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. That's not, Is this the time for that nonsense? You really need to speak up and be clear. Maybe give a time like, hey, by August, you know, can we work this out? Can we... Can I put my two weeks in? I mean, you see what I'm saying? That's an obstacle to be open, free, honest. Don't be a chicken. Okay? Be nice to your empress.